Hi, Jamie and Greg, and welcome to Ace TV. Thank you. I see the Ace girls are training with the Morton Bay girls tonight. How beneficial for Ace is having this link? Um, yeah, it's obviously very beneficial. Um, as you can see, the girls are training together. Um, it's, it's great for my girls to be able to learn from some of them girls that are playing at that level. Um, obviously, there's other benefits as well. Sky has a great knowledge of, of the women's game. All right, we good? A lot of the time, there's girls coming in to me asking, asking about coming down to Ace and I can message Sky and see, see what he knows and, and get his input on players as well. So yeah, it's, it's really beneficial. And how do you see it, Craig? Yeah, uh, basically as as Morton Bay uh, from the side of it, we've got a pool of players we can call on through Ace, um, obviously through the juniors, um, with Morton Bay obviously being only 13s, 15s and 18s. There's a, those gap years where we can hopefully get the Ace Morton Bay girls go back into Ace, and Ace girls come into to Morton Bay, so we can we can make sure that we keep uh, women's players, girls, women's players here from from under eights right through until senior. So you know, working with both clubs, it, it's really what we need to do. So does that make it easier for the Ace girls to be noticed by our NPLW club? Yeah, I think that's pretty obvious from what's going on behind. Um, if there's girls there that are are doing well, then Sky's going to notice that. Um, possibly moving forward, once once we get the girls into higher competition as well, and we bring in higher quality of players, and yeah, definitely, that's what that's what we want. Yeah, it's, as Jamie said, it's definitely right. If, if these players, you know, it gives them some something to strive for, uh, they can see the level that uh, the Morton Bay girls are at, and you know, it gives them something that they want to, you know, they want to have a go at and uh, you know train harder and and hopefully that yeah you know, they're seen and they can go from there great so jamie two games unbeaten now do you think the team's beginning to gel yeah they get in there um i've said it a few times to the girls now the, the five games we've played so far there's only been one where i think that we didn't deserve to get something out of the game and um, right from the start they've shown the, the potentials there um the performances are there they're knocking the ball around well yeah, even on the weekend, we probably had 70% of the play and just again didn't take on the chances that we could have done. Uh, but I think one week we're going to click and, and we might just blow someone away, I reckon. So. <laughs> and I understand you got some new players coming? Yeah, um, Sabrina, who scored the second on the weekend, she's just come down. Um, a girl that I've worked with before, good, strong, powerful girl. She's got goals in her. Um, and there's another couple of potential players coming down, yeah, so it should be interesting. Great. So, Greg and Jamie, thanks for talking to ACTV. Thanks, Ray. Cheers.